we took a really long break because uh, we had some real life shit going on for everyone. But like, Hell that's no. cool. That's and not it's what happened. We got eaten by ghosts. Or... That's that counts as real life shit. <laughs> oh, fair enough. Carry on. <laughs> anyway, I cut my way out of the stomach of the boss ghost, and then uh, I helped everyone else out. So. <laughs> Help! Help! <laughs> it's impossible to get out of clothes! <laughs> anyway, if Avi wasn't such a little, like, complaining <laughs> complain, you'd realize that ectoplasm is delicious and good for you. Ooh. Terrifying, thank you. I have just walked in the door back for, back from two weeks of work. I leave you guys for two weeks and this is what you do without me? Don't worry about it. Hey, well, I, I, I drape myself over you and get all the disgusting- I'm sorry, hold on. on. Are we recording this? Is this a thing we're recording? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We're getting recorded. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I just wanted to make that clear. Because I have no idea what you guys are talking about. No, no, don't worry, it's fine. It's <laughs> fine, don't worry about it. Yeah, oh. Uni is still currently trapped in uh, her Lotus Eater Machine style ghost. I haven't been mm. able to get her out yet, but I stuffed a microphone in there, so we're good. I have a knife. I mean, it's I a want... ghost, so... I have a... Uh, I take the goo that Vamp is... Been so so kind enough to, to the ectoplasmic goon. I spread it on the knife. Uh, doesn't that just make it a blunter knife? <laughs> no. This is horrible. Why are we doing this? I have enchanted the knife. I have enchanted the knife, and I have cut Uni out. Should I leave and come back when you guys? Are <laughs> 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 Remember, you're here forever. Oh, no. Uh, anyways. You made this decision, Uni, on your own volition. Anyway, I love all of you so much, and that's why you get to deal with this. Uni, Alright, then I guess Uni doesn't get to fucking play anymore. No playing for Uni. Everyone shun Uni. <laughs> Uni, come back. Vamp, I'm going to beat the shit out of you. Uni, come back to Uni's us. fucking dead. <laughs> Died in the horrible ghost swallowing. Uni, come back. Uni, I love you. <laughs> okay, let's actually start, though. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, Uni is dead, and I will no longer be referring to them for the entire thing, because they left when shit got hard. <laughs> I just refuse to, in, like, listen to what is, to me, complete gibberish. <laughs> You've you been around us for so long, you think you. you would be able to translate a little. Not when I'm this tired. Alright, that's- why the fuck- why are you tired? It's two. Because- Don't worry about it. Life? Alright, that's yeah, fair. Anyway, uh, everybody. Hello. Hi. Anyway, welcome to Dreamers Crest. Hello. Hello. Uh, a short four minutes after I've started it. <laughs> anyway, um, so uh, when we left off, everybody went into the mountain for good times, and they went, blah dee da dee da and oh shit, a big orp! And uh, there was a big monster, and it had two heads, and he was, like, locked like chained to the thing we took him out so now we can go deeper into the mountain for better shit which is cool unfortunately the dude's kind of traumatized and that sucks nor actually did a good deck save so that's why uh we have a new friend i forgot his name um, uh i think his name is piak and race and that was what not gave him each I don't head has it its head own head. name uh <laughs> and i believe i think the single name for him was hark yeah. Yeah, it was hard. Thank you. Uh, these are things that I should have written down, but I didn't. Anyway. Now you can oh. write them down now. <laughs> oh, no, that's fair. Uh, alright, here's my very real pen, and... 
If someone could type it in our chat, that would help me out as well. No, I'm I'm actually looking for paper, which I don't have for some reason. Pass you. Uh, I'll just fucking I'll just uh. Mm -hmm. and, there we go. And heart. There we go. I wrote it down. I'm so smart. Anyway, hey. uh, there we go. hello and welcome. And uh, we had a bunch of shit happen, uh, including like, uh, you're going to correct my spelling. I'm going to kick your butt. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, uh, fucking. I lost my place. Now we gotta start over again. Hi, everybody. <laughs> oh, no, no. Please. Anyway, um, uh, so you guys have been having a good time. Uh, you're trying to get everybody settled. Uh, Petra and, uh, god damn it. Hold on a second. I've got notes. Um, Petra and Nor, uh, went out. And, uh, they, they bought a few things at a fun thing, uh, and then there was some shenanigans that happened. Uh, someone got thrown into a river, and then someone yes. got, uh, thrown into a river on purpose. Uh, so, uh, that's what, it. Yeah, so now Nora and Petra were having a good day out. Uh, the rest of you, I don't know what you were doing with your time. You were doing something. But, uh, in-game, it's been three weeks since, uh, the last time we checked up on you. Uh, yeah, so uh, you guys have just been helping out with the town and all that, and you've been building shit, and um, uh, specifically, uh, we've got um, uh, we've got uh, you guys have saved up uh, con points and con points, constitution points. Basically, they're they're like your stamina points. That's that's how much you can fucking uh, build shit. And, uh, everybody, I have a handy dandy chart. Uh... It's the handy dandy chart. Yeah. Uh, if you, uh, head over to the NPC NPC stats, uh, if you go to the bottom, there is, uh, tabbies. There's little tabbies. So, uh, I'm gonna place that in, um... Where is the stock? Is... Hold on. <laughs> Where is the here. stock? <laughs> right here. Thank you. Yeah, I just, I had to find the right channel. Anyway, um, so, uh, we've got this over here, and, uh, we've got characters, buildings, potential buildings, potential townspeople. So, uh, right now, the amount of buildings we have is we have, uh, we have, like, base buildings, uh, we've got, uh, I need to update this real quick. Uh, the tailor shop has been built. Uh, hold on. I need to sign in, because otherwise it won't let me edit, sorry. But, um, uh, if you take a look, uh, the stuff that's on the sheet is, uh, a recording of what is currently we have. Okay. And then, uh, under potential buildings is stuff that we could get. Uh, CP cost to build is, uh, over here. And basically, what this is saying is that, uh, you could build a bunch of houses, you could make another field, uh, you could, uh, do a bunch of, like, uh, you could build a post office, a branch. Basically, this is the list of this. You guys have 300... Hold on. You have 15... Time stamp. God damn it. It's been three weeks. You get 150 points per week. Ooh. Six. Okay. Maps of this hour? 600. 150 times 4, so 150 times 2 is 300, times another 2 is 600. Thank you for being our math person! Like, genuinely, <laughs> that sounded sarcastic, but I'm very glad that I didn't have to spend my own brain power on that. Anyway, um, so, uh, you guys are, of course, limited by the amount of, uh, of specifically, uh, if you want to build a bunch of houses, you're limited by the amount of material you need to build each one. Special buildings, however, uh, only take CP, you just have to put in the work for it. Uh, mm. You currently have 600 points, which means you can get a fair amount of things, but you want to 
you want to consider what you want the most. And then, uh, for townspeople, you still need, like, houses and shit, because not everyone mm -hmm. can live where they work. Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. Like, yeah, do you want old man, uh, McGucket to live in the peep shed with the birds? Not everyone <laughs> Wouldn't can be, be Noctis. <laughs> not everyone can be Noctis. Noctis specifically, like, made his building with, with oh, the tools. second floor is where I'm going to sleep. Yeah. <laughs> And then the mm -hmm. tailor shop was not this helped out Kami and was like, you're gonna want a place to put your face when you're not working. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, and then Kami's younger siblings were just like, we can sleep on the floor. And Kami is just like, no, I we have rooms. We're gonna make some rooms. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I have a question. Mm -hmm. Just so I know I'm reading this right. Uh, for item generation, that means, uh, I guess that's an item... I'm just, like looking at houses for potential buildings. Yeah. Uh, bonus points ten produces items. Uh, and I see an item generation says two common items slash weak. Uh, yeah. Like uh, a common item would be like um, something that you could make on your own time if you had the materials. Mm. Uh, a product is something that you need an animal for. So like. Mm. Uh, butter, milk, uh, like, I would say a common item would be, like, jam or something. Okay, I have a question for you. Uh, Owl, what would I, what would March need, uh, March wants to get a painter's kit. Mm-hmm. All right, if March wants a painter's kit, uh, all right, so today the main thing that we're looking to do is, uh, all right, can we all? What buildings do you think you need the most? Hmm. I'm gonna leave um, it to like everyone else, cause uh, I mean I. I have oh, lots of God. peep shed. Hold on, <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and say like, I mean the the child doesn't doesn't care. They're just here to hang out. Out of character, we have a lot of people who don't know how to read. A school would be pretty good. There we yeah. go. Yeah. 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 We're gonna okay. need a school. We're gonna need housing for, you know, yeah. housing purposes. Yeah, so probably school and uh, and a house or two. Yeah. I'm wondering whether a post office is a good idea, considering how often uh, characters have been traveling outside of uh, between the games. If I remember right, Hark is in the middle of building a, a post office. Mm hmm. So someone's like, already work worked. He's working on it because, like, he needs something to work on, otherwise he'll think about his past and that's a <laughs> No, don't want to do that. Um... Point, well, point is, is that we do have... Don't have time to unpack all that, but point is, is that we do have someone already starting it. Exactly. Yeah. So, uh, he, he's working on it with the, uh, there was another dilapidated building, and, uh, mm -hmm. he's been working on it. It's going, uh, pretty slowly, uh... Uh, let's see, um, specifically if we look at- I have, like, a list of, like, man, I had shit, hold on, yes, right here, uh, here we go, I had a list of fucking how much it takes to get, like, trees and shit, I'm so angry, where did it go? Hmm, anyway, uh, this is, uh, the, uh, tailor shop, uh, this is- uh, and then this one is going to be post office, which is a work in progress. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. Uh, and I'm opening up my map right now because uh, I, I need it because I need to figure out where we're putting things. Uh, mm -hmm. It's just handy for me. Also, it's yeah. handy for you. And it's handy for everyone, and you cannot tell that I am postponing my thought because I'm trying to find this. I gently pat you. You can do it. We build a beautiful. We're so location. valid. Okay, um load, you son of a bitch. Okay. <laughs> load. We command you to load. <laughs> Here we go. There's the quick file. Alright, 
So this is, um, this is the thing. I don't remember what I put that red square there for. Hmm. Was that like the, the field for the, for the farming? Yeah, cause no, Tia put the up the- The brown square here is for the field. Okay. I don't remember what the red one was. I'll remember we... eventually. It'll come back to me, either way. Just letting you know, we cannot see it at the moment, so... <laughs> oh shit, I forgot. Hold on. You're good. <laughs> Alright, you know. Go. There we go. Oh, that was the playground. Oh, right, yes, thank you. Uh, Alright, I need to actually write this shit down, so one second. Uh... Now we got a playground. Yep, it's because I think the kids deserve it. They do. <laughs> yes. It's true. They, also may, they may also really need it. Mm -hmm. I just think they're neat, okay? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Alright. Uh, this here is the tailor's shop. Mm -hmm. This is on a separate layer, so you don't have to worry that I'm printing anything directly on here. This is still okay. a dilapidated building, but this is going to be the post office, so I'm going to, uh... Oh, you're gonna run out of colors so quickly. <laughs> you're gonna run out of colors! <laughs> um, the, the CP cost for two weeks, how does that work with the, uh, the CP that we've already got? Fuck. Hold on. Uh, the CP that you've already got has built up, uh, over each week. You get, uh, 150 with each new week. So, um, and then, uh... Each new week, and then... Oh, and then, uh, specifically, uh, the cost to 10 for two weeks is, uh... I'm giving you guys the option to backlog right now. Mm hmm so, uh, you can decide how, like, if you wanted to do houses, you have, uh, you have 600 points of CP right now. However, you need material to make houses. So, uh, you can choose, oh, I want enough to make a house, so you can go, that means that, uh, you can say that during the past four weeks, we took down seven trees and, uh, three quarry blocks, uh, and that means that, uh, 35 plus 15, that's 50 CP, and then, uh, you're like, oh, now we have enough to fucking do the thing, uh, and then, mm -hmm. uh, so that's, you spent 50 CP on, uh, mining and stuff, uh, mm -hmm. and then you spent 50, uh, CP on housing, which means that you spent 100 CP in order to get the materials to build the house, uh, and mm. you spent 100 CP, uh, like, to build the house. Like, oh, okay. Yeah, All so right. it's, it's basically, we've got stored up points here. You can choose mm -hmm. uh, to use CP to buy uh, item materials that you need. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You can also, like, uh, put auto things on it. Like, uh, if you have uh, the field, which is, like, four blocks, you can, uh, right here, uh, if you have the field and you want to plant things, uh, you can uh, choose to tend it for five uh, CP per row, and each field has, let's say, five rows? So, uh, mm -hmm. so if you spend 25 CP per week, you can get, uh, ten items per row. So, uh, you can get, uh, Dang. 250 items, which will go a long way towards starting a trade option. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh, also, trade. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, it also means food for the people who live here. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Very important. It's sounding like we're gonna have to divvy up our actions in order to make it so that we have things that can help run the town as well as expand it. There we go! Yeah, so, um, that's the whole point of this, is, like, you can choose to do fast expansion, but then you'll end up with a lot of empty buildings. You can choose to recruit people, but they don't have anywhere to live, and they're, like, sleeping in the woods. Uh... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You can choose to do all the special buildings, but, like, none of the upkeep that goes into the special buildings, and therefore you won't have any item generation, so you'll just have a bunch of shit, but no reason for people to come into your, sh to your, um... Town. Yeah. Yeah. So, um... You- It's one of those things where you gotta be balanced about it. You gotta think about it. Ugh, thinking. Alright, well, 
let's divide and conquer then. Yeah. Mm -hmm. right. Patrick can build houses. March can al March can also do uh, can help build a house as well. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna add a big tab to this just so I can remember how many items we have. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm makes sense. Makes sense. Graham is here for the smart stuff. <laughs> Unfortunately, right. I am not Graham. <laughs> so I do not know what the smart stuff is. Where is here for charisma shit? <laughs> well, if you guys are here for charisma stuff, I would say since we're making the houses, you can help. You can try and get people to fill them. That's my. That was my thinking. But we also want to be able to, because Uni was right. I think we do need a school because we at least got we've got enough kids and enough yeah. people who don't know how to do stuff that. Oh, that reminds me, actually. I need to roll something really quick. Oh, for the... Nope, the ring isn't active today. Thank right. you. Well, cool. Okay, so how, how much CP does it cost to make a... Okay, so 20 for a school and 20 for a house. So... Hmm. You sure? I'm... Uh, CP costs 10 for two... If, if I'm looking at the right thing. Oh, to 10. Because, yeah, to tend, it just, it means that, like, if you put a person in charge of it. Uh, but specifically, the CP cost to build it right here is, for a school, it's 100. I, okay. um, I put the, uh, some of the numbers in the player discussion so far. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, because if, ah, if okay. you don't have the tab open, this is very confusing. Mm -hmm. Okay. But, like, we gotta talk about how the sausage gets made. This is a town-building game. It is! Okay, so here's... This is really interesting. I'm actually really loving this. Yeah. I'm having a good time. I wanted to set this up because I fucking... I love, like, Harvest Moon and build your town and have a good fucking time. I played mm -hmm. so much Animal Crossing. I bet you are so, uh, mm -hmm. so valid. I love you. Also, I'm mm -hmm. unfortunately dead after the game. It's that okay. That's, like, that's why we have specifically, like, right here... Like, you don't have to pay attention. Like, I think Uni mm -hmm. fell asleep, and that's fine. I'm awake, <laughs> but yeah, I am I am very much like, these are a many words. Yeah, there's a lot of numbers, and eek. But... Good at town building games. Potentially, However, potentially in the future, we could have, have this be in, like, DMs and stuff, and then... Yeah. Just yeah. be like, yeah. oh, we can have these buildings built during the break before the next game. And yeah, then... yeah, that was initially my plan, but like we got really busy and I forgot to tell people. It's, that this is fair. might That's not fair be enough. the worst thing to happen though on like on mm -hmm. recording for the first one so people understand what mm -hmm. we're doing behind the scenes as yeah, we go exactly. along. This is true. This is true. There's behind the scenes things that happen. Neat. All right. So uh, today, I think the main thing that was like character-wise that's gonna happen uh, is, um, uh, you guys, specifically, uh, Kami, I'm gonna say that you guys are, uh, doing whatever, and Kami is sort of bustling through the town, specifically looking for Nor. Huh? Is this gonna be when freaking Nor and Petra roll back into town from, <laughs> from shopping trip? <laughs> yeah, so, uh, like, Kami's like, hey, have you seen the- he's, like, he's kind of wiry and, like, dark hair and, uh, just, like, asking, and Noctis is like, oh, yeah, uh, what's his name? The one who lives here, um. <laughs> you mean, like, the kid? No, 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 uh, we- we- we all know who the child is. Okay. <laughs> uh, yes, and child. I know Petra, and I know March. And I know the zombie person what? who never sleeps. Are you talking about Hark? Oh yes, uh, I am. Thank you so much. Okay. Yeah, he just he does not sleep. Neither head does. Oh, and then that's... we've also got the shifty shop person who's never in town. Uh I think that's Grum. And then 
Yeah, yeah I just cannot random. place the last one's name. He's just so, you know, he doesn't stand out. No more. Petra gestures one hand to Nor right um, beside <laughs> You know, it's like some days I can almost hear their voice. <laughs> Wonder what happened to him. Nope. <laughs> so, uh, Petra, you look at Nor and you see that he got kind of distracted by a passing butterfly. Kami is just like elbow Nor and point to Kami. Uh, Listen, what? I I know you love to goof, Noctis, but like I I need to find I need to find Nor. Where did he go? And Hello? Noctis is just like I do not know <laughs> while looking directly at Nor. <laughs> Nor kind of snaps his fingers like, "Hello, hi." <laughs> Me? It's that weird person who keeps lurking outside my shop for food. Can't <laughs> 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 you just size? <laughs> yeah, and then uh, Noctis grins and uh, says, "He's right over there." And uh, caught. Kami kind of like, she spins on her heel and is just like, there you are! Okay, so, uh, we don't really have any, like, communications in and out of town yet. Uh, Hark is still working on the post office. Uh, so, um, I, I know I said that I would help you out with making clothes and stuff. I don't have any of the materials I uh, need to do. Uh, actually. And Petra's actually gonna reach for a hammer space. I'm gonna roll the d10 real fast. That's a five. Uh, Petra actually reaches into her hammer space and pulls out an extremely loyal paper airplane that she bought <laughs> on their shopping trip. And I'm gonna copy and paste it so that y'all can see what it does. Here you go. <laughs> oh yeah. I, this is a very nice folded sheet of paper. Uh, I, I think how it works is you can uh, write a message on it and specify a specific person and it'll fly to them. I don't know oh. if it'll help, but... Uh, oh, no, no, I got you. Thank you, thank you so much. However, I, I do have to, um, specify that I don't have any money right now. So even if I wanted to buy the materials to make the thing for Nor that he requested, um, I don't have any money. Which means that you need to come up with the materials. I, I'll put in the effort just for the sheer labor of love. I love making things, but I don't have the materials. Uh, when you said that he had to put in the work to make the materials, you guys don't even have to roll inside on this. He looks like, ugh. <laughs> Petra just gives him a flat look. He rolls up a cigarette and he's just like, think for a second, Petra. Fire and letter. Well, this. Well, pretty boy, if you're gonna survive around here, you need to learn, learn to put the work in. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> She's right, and Kami just sort of goes over and takes a, a, an identical stand pose to Petra, crossed arms. <laughs> Door, looking away and he's getting her. ganged up uh, on. <laughs> and then Noctis comes up next to him and says, uh, so, I've been friends with Kami for a while. You are not getting out of this. You might as well accept your fate. He pats your <laughs> shoulder and then he wanders off. Can I cancel my request or something? No. <laughs> Uh, I got really excited about making a jacket, and now you have to make this happen. <laughs> this is a no refund store. <laughs> you put in the uh, you put in the request, and you're going to get your request, even if I have to drag you. Kicking you're and you're going to get what you woods. want, whether you want it or not. <laughs> <laughs> if I have to drag you kicking and screaming into the woods and come back out with you and a fully butchered war, that's what's gonna happen. Look, it's not even that I don't want to put the work in, although by fire I don't want to. Uh, all of my spells are 
fire. We are trying to get leather. You you do realize that you can't hunt animals with magic. Most magics destroy the inborn material. You have to yes. fight them with with weaponry. Yes, that is what I'm getting at. And here Nor looks at Petra. Petra, who has seen Nor um Nor's unfortunate sex. <laughs> going. <laughs> Kami, Kami then, like, uh, steps forward, gently places, like, a hand in front of you and says, no, no, no. He's gotta learn. Uh, and then, uh, reaches into her pocket and pulls out a knife. Oh my god. <laughs> like, it's a dagger. Uh, and then she, she hands it over to, uh, Nor and says, alright, the blunt edge goes in your hand and the pointy end goes into the thing you don't want to move anymore. <laughs> he doesn't drop it, but he sure fumbles with it. Alright, you want you, all right, you got a grip on it? You got a grip on the end? Yes. Alright, so uh, I'm. what you have to do is you have to go and you have to find an animal. I don't care. Old, sickly, uh, diseased. I don't care. Whatever you think you can bring down. And you have to try and get it. Leather takes enchantment really well. So if I'm going to make you a leather jacket, it has to be leather. Mm. Uh, <laughs> Petra's just sitting here sweating. Petra, you know how bad his sex is. <laughs> Alright, so she now you've got a knife. experience falling into a river after him. <laughs> now you've got a knife, and you're gonna go into the woods, and you're gonna go and get it! You're gonna go oh. get the materials for your jacket. Yeah. And Petra, and Petra, you're gonna stay right here. Can I at least recruit someone? Recruit you can recruit me? someone as long as it is not Petra. Because, honestly, Petra's kinda still... You're very wet right now. You've got a There's lot of water march. all over you. There's no march, and Nor's gonna leave to find March. <laughs> Seriously, how did you get so wet? Uh, long story short, he fell in a river. I jumped after him. Uh, oh, God. Oh, a... oh, no, I just gave him a knife. Yeah. I'm gonna roll another text <laughs> it, It'll be fine. It'll you be fine. You hear a screaming in the distance. <laughs> <laughs> it'll, it'll be fine. Anyway, here, I, I've got some, I've got some towels. You, you could use one. Come on. Uh, all right. And <laughs> Petra's just gonna follow after. <laughs> it's gonna go great. Oh, yeah. this is already wonderful. <laughs> So, like, Kami leads you upstairs, gives you a towel, uh, Kami's younger siblings are there, uh, and you guys, uh, hang out, and, like, Kami shows you the tricks of your trade, and we cut immediately to the source of the screaming. <laughs> I feel like Nor tripped, and the knife, like, left his hands, and, god. Uh, Fable, do you want to say that March, because March is a monk, and I know monks are just like missile, do you want to say that March has practiced the knife? March is focused on something else, so I feel more March. Ra March, uh, uh, hears a thunk, uh, behind him. Goes, huh? And he lifts up his head, and he doesn't. He looks around, but doesn't see the knife that is now lodged in his hat. <laughs> no. Hi, March. Don't. Uh, um. Hi. Oh, hi. Not looking at the knife in his hat. Hey, uh. I'm just gonna yeah, roll. Um, I'm just gonna roll a sleight of hand real quick. As a six, uh, <laughs> nor you see March not uh, not so sneakily uh, shove something behind him. What's that you got there? Uh, uh, it I uh, March kind of looks down at it. From what you could tell, it looks like a. a <laughs> it looks like a whole bunch of sticks and uh, leaves. Oh, hold on, hold on. It. Dog. Anyways, Zarya will do it. 
He who. He who indeed. Oh my god, cat, oh, what get are, off. What are Child and Star doing? Um, Child has probably been hanging out in, uh, the, uh, the playground. Oh, baby. Baby. Oh, baby's is back. I mean, like, the, you probably, they're still a little bit hard to track down, and event, like, if you're looking, you'll realize that, like, they've done that thing where they, the, like, set up a little space underneath the slide or whatever, and just hang out there a bunch. Aww. Can I see if, um, Star can find the child just to check in on them? Sure. Yeah, roll investigate. Oh, good. Also, I'm just saying that Graham is in fact in town. They're just buzzing their child. So if you see a bag somewhere... Nope. They that won't do it. Child. You, I mean, you're looking around, but uh, you'll get distracted by... Uh, in uh just like a little bit past uh the just a little bit past the playground uh where uh nor wandered off to with his uh knife uh and like uh march is also sitting there with like leaves and sticks so basically you guys are like right here mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and um uh Uh, you 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 were looking and you're like God I wonder where I wonder where the child went uh, and then uh, you you saw Nord trip you saw the knife go flying you saw it get stuck in uh, in March's hat and like that just totally distracted you yeah yeah <laughs> well um, March has probably got that handled. Yeah. Maybe. Maybe it's not a bad idea just to keep an eye on the situation in case of any more flying <laughs> knives. Don't worry about it. Yeah, it's speaking probably, of which, it's, it's probably right. fine. It's probably normal. It's probably normal. No. So, uh. Did you need something, Nor? Then Nora gets distracted by whatever was behind Marcus' back and sits like, Oh, yeah, uh, are you free today? Uh... Why? Come on, is there any way to treat a friend? But, uh... Tommy's forcing me to go hunt. Oh. Oh no. Yes, oh no. I am aware. I am aware of this. Tommy gave me a knife. March looks at Nor's hands, then looks at Nor questioningly. <laughs> Nor gestures at March's hat. March reaches up and feels at his hat, and then his hat, and then his eyes widen a bit as he uh, feels, oh, there's a blade there, and he just thunk, takes it out and looks at it. You can tell why <laughs> this isn't a good idea on any level at all. Yeah. There's, there's a little hole in your hat now. Yeah, March looks at the knife, looks at Nor, and March is just gonna... March is just gonna slowly put the knife into his arm and let it sink in. Right, so you're gonna need help. Yes. Okay. Do you have money? Uh, he kind of um, looks in and he sighs and goes, No, I think I um, used it recently. I have none. Insight. Okay, let's go. I don't freaking believe that you used all your money. It's 21. Oh. No, he actually did use all his money recently. <sighs> March size. For once, he was actually telling the truth. Okay. I'll... I'll still help, but... You've gotta help me get something in return. Oh, what's that? 
Uh, March uh, glances over in the direction of uh, where the kid is uh, before leaning over to Noor to, to whisper. I need to get something for the kid, but I don't want them to know yet. Ominous. All right. Uh, sure, I'll help you out with that. It takes like another puff of the cigarette. Wait. <laughs> Star is still looking for the child now. I don't know. I'm wondering whether Star is listening into this conversation or not. No, that's fair. What is Star doing? Um, I think they are listening into this conversation. <laughs> I like the idea that neither of them has looked like below like chest height. Yeah, she, and so the just... camera just kind of tilts downwards to see to show Star looking between the two of them. Yeah. Standing there. <laughs> just um. Uh, I could uh, have the <laughs> you guys were busy. I'm still rolling perception just to see. Eight, no. Nope. Eight. <laughs> Mike just distracted. Yeah, you were a little. Yeah. He's a big guy. <laughs> yeah, Noah. Um, Star's standing next to you. Oh, hey, Star. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Silent. Get, uh, like the small... night. <laughs> You get a small gesture of, uh, do you guys need any help? It depends. Do you want to use a knife? Do you have money? <laughs> oh. <laughs> this is terrible. <laughs> These questions together are very sus. <laughs> hey, uh, um, a, uh, X through the knife, and then a picture of with also an X through it as a no, I am not going anywhere near a knife and you at the same time. <laughs> um, and then I'm gonna roll hammer space. Yep, uh, he pulls out a couple of coins. Is like, uh, how how much do you need? Uh, how much does a painter's kit cost? Alright, so uh, it depends on uh, how good the painter's kit is. Because you've got the you've got the painter's kit for kids where it's like uh, you get one brush and like a long twelve pack of watercolors and it's by uh Mayola. Incredible. And it's pretty good. Uh, and then you've got like oh you, you buy a palette and you buy a bunch of really nice brushes and you buy uh, tubes of paint and shit, and they're like acrylics or oils or some shit, and you gotta buy canvas. So it depends on how good you want this. Let's also, go with you can... simple. Why yeah, just a simple like, guy? You can also get like the, the multi-art pack, which is, it has markers, it has pastel, it's got some colored pencils, Let... and a watercolor work. kit in it, and Don't it's- Don't gotta work about ink. Yeah. You look at it and you're like, oh, this is so cool, but then, like, you use it and after two days, all of the things in it break. Yeah, let's just yep. start with something s simple but sturdy. <laughs> okay, so you, you want to get the Mayola watercolor kit, uh, so, uh, hold on a second, as I do some real-life research. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, me drawing shit posts. <laughs> Okay, so for uh, the normal eight pack, it is looking at this. Uh, it's uh, it's it looks like it's about four bucks. So like four. Which gold? means it would be like four coins. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Stock can give you four coins. March has sparkly eyes. You Aww. you're gonna need paper for this, but. No, he doesn't. All right. No, he doesn't. You can paint wherever you want if you're brave enough. Yeah. All right. Yeah. There listen, Mar this. March. March uh, spent spent a, a, a whole time painting a wall with the kid, so he knows the kid does not care where he uh, is not going to care about a canvas. Probably. I can't wait for you guys to use watercolors on a building. I mean, other thing is, Star actually does have paper on them. So. Oh no, that's fair then. Okay. Yeah, actually, I'm gonna roll another. Uh, I'm gonna roll another hammer spin. Oh no! That's oh, a, it's a Yay! 
Oh, what do you pull out? <laughs> the, the rabbit comes out of his hat. Yes! Ah! <laughs> Bunny. What? The, the rabbit immediately just like twitches its nose and then starts hopping around. Yeah, um, there's a, there's a surprised look from Star. Uh, they pat the bunny a little bit before put, putting it, placing it no, gently no, no. back in the... No, 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 no. You have to roll dex. <laughs> oh, no. Dex saves? The rabbit. Bunnies are fast. You know fast. what it's like trying to catch a bunny. <laughs> the bunny's like, freedom? Freedom? <laughs> I've been Finally, in that for so long. Years. Oh no, that's <laughs> won't do it. Uh, the bunny slips right out of your hands and then like darts straight for the nearest enclosed space where it can hide, and that's under the front part of the slide. Ah! <laughs> bunny, bunny has gone to child. <laughs> and the bunny like is like, oh, I'm safe now, and then immediately like turns his head and then looks into the big red eyes of a surprised child. <laughs> Hey child, the bunny is white and also the bunny is white and also has red eyes. <laughs> that was an animal handling check. <laughs> uh, the two of you stare into each other's. Your eyes are the exact same color, uh, and uh, there is an understanding between the two of it you. It was meant to be. This pure Ch like horse child girl just like lies down on their stomach and. Um, waits for Bunny to come closer. Yeah, like, there's this pure, like, horse girl moment where you just sort of <laughs> sit there and you look very quietly and you're just like, Bunny? And the bunny looks back and is just like, Oh no, this person seems chill. Hop. Hop, hop. Sniff, sniff. Sniff, sniff. Hop. Hop. And then, uh, gently is just, like, uh, nibbling at your sleeve. Child just like staring with absolute wonder and gently like one finger stroking the top of its head. Aww. Oh, the bunny leans in. That that was a really good animal handling roll. Okay, Star has child, no idea where this bunny has gone. Tail is just like twitching back and forth wildly. <laughs> or just like nor just pipes it up after all of them watch the bunny, and then he's just like, well, that rabbit's gone. Yeah, that was that was an investigation. That was a six. Star has lost his bunny. Yeah, no. you, you just saw the bunny fucking Mine take now. off like it, <laughs> it darted. Just whoop, gone, and you were like, oh shit, my rabbit! I'm just gonna take the four gold that he's been given and pocket it, and uh, doesn't know what to make of the bunny situation, but uh, looks at Star and goes, I will pay you back. When I also have more money. <laughs> yeah, you just get a thumbs up. Then, He's not worried. Then March turns to Noor. So you still need help hunting. Yep. Okay. March, March looks at Star. Do you want to come hunting? I can, I can fight animals, but I think someone, I think there should be two people one who's able to fight, and one that can watch him. And March just points at Nor. <laughs> Go on, yeah, I, I think I think that's a, like a pondering. Do I really want to leave Nor only supervised by one person, followed by a Yeah, okay, I'm coming. <laughs> In the meantime, uh, the bunny has now officially decided. Oh, this is my favorite person. That's right. That's a real good spot for scritches. And has hopped into like uh, into the child's uh, arms. Aww. Good child is just like this is their day now. <laughs> Good, wonderful. This is their day. The whole day dedicated to rabbits. My yes. God. Bunny. 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 Don't come looking Bunny. for them. They're busy. <laughs> <laughs> I, I I will say Star would like their rabbit back at some point, but they don't need it back straight away. It'll be we'll fine. <laughs> Shared custody of Bunny. <laughs> it's like, I'm sorry, you, you gotta give this child your rabbit now. <laughs> but the, the two of them have been together for so long. 
<laughs> it will be up to the buddy to decide. Yeah, we'll, we'll leave that up to a roll of the dice. I will that bridge when we way. get there. I will admit, by the way, I'm very glad that neither Tart nor Mark is paying attention to Nora when the rabbit ran away. Oh, boy. Oh, dear. Uh, so, uh, now you guys have decided, alright, we've got our group together. We're good now. Nor probably won't die. Probably. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> so, uh, you're, like, you're you're wandering off, you're like, God, where do we go to even get, like, things to hunt? And, uh, you, you run into, uh, Greb. Literally, oh. like, the anime trope <laughs> of you run into each other, papers go flying, and you both land on your butts. Amazing. Hey, Crim's, like, climbing out of their bag. <laughs> <laughs> That's an 11. Boo! Nor, nor... Nor doesn't tumble or anything. That's pretty good. But there's a stumble. <laughs> he has to say face in front of Grim. Yeah, like you, you bonk and you almost fall over and you reach out your hand and you grab his wrist <laughs> and you hang there for a second and then you're like, ah, oh, I'm not dead. Uh, and then <laughs> March, whose wrist you're holding, is like, uh, are you, are you dead now? Hi. <laughs> Your hand is covered in goop. Yup, covered in ink. Sank your fingers into March's arm. Yeah, March still has no shirt. <laughs> still lacking. Uh, but yeah. What are y'all doing here? Hunting. <laughs> There's a, a picture of a star's head of Na wielding a knife. <laughs> ah. Oh, I do like as a side as a side note. I think March uh, is gonna offer his hat once again for for Star to to sit on. Yeah, Star would have taken that that that, that offer definitely. Yeah. I think actually, Nor Nor snaps his fingers and he's just like, wait, hold on, and he peers into like the bag tied around his waist, and then he pulls out the dagger. And like, oh, I still have this. Oh no. March is gonna reach over and take it and take it from him. <laughs> wait, That's no, good. this is my dagger. Do you know how to use it? Uh, daggers use strength actually, not dexterity, so... I don't think so, actually. I don't think so. Be checking. That's weird, though, because in the DMV it says that um, two attack is plus three instead of, um, you know, plus one. A, a minus yep. one. Mm. It might be borked. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, it might be borked. Uh, all hella- all handheld weapons, like melee weapons, use your deck. Okay, in which Unless case- Unless it, like, specifies strength. Like, Petra's is strength, specifically, but- Yeah, like, specifically it's to hit its dex, and then the oh, amount of yeah. damage you do is strength. Oh, yeah, that's, that's a dirty one. Incredible. 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 Mark, I'm Tried to take the dagger out of Nora's hands, and his fingers must have failed him or something because they twitch and like the dagger like kind of like goes flying. <laughs> does Mar does March get a fucking dagger in his hand now? Yeah. Ow. <laughs> uh, you look at it and then like uh, you you hear uh, a slight hiss at the back of your mind, and then you hear like an ooh, and then it like uh, the the dagger gets swallowed into your arm. <sighs> Staring at it. I'm not getting that. Just like, you just eat my dagger? Uh, and then in the back of your mind, you, you feel a very quiet, very satisfied mind now. In my defense, you did just stab me with it. <laughs> you don't want this back? Or? Well, I'm gonna get the Greb Grabster back and it starts to leave. Because fuck this. <laughs> You, you do get a pleasant wave from Star as you go. I think they're the only one paying attention to the fact that you're leaving. <laughs> uh, March, you can in fact try to get the dagger out of your body, but you gotta do, um... March already has the other dagger that, that was not as consumed, so... Yeah. Specifically, this one, this one was given. It was put directly into his hand, so, uh... Um... Yeah. Whatever is also, uh, like, whatever, like, the other half of your body is thinking right now, or whatever. Yeah. Uh, it's, it's just like, oh, in hand? Ours? 
Ours yeah. given to us? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, March is like, yeah, that's gone. Yeah. No <laughs> give, only step. <laughs> no give, only take. Yeah, sorry, Nord. Uh, I... Like, Nord is top offended that everyone, like, you know, like, judges him for his time skills, but also, like, top, yeah, no, that's actually really Yeah, fair. I get I it. Not <laughs> Anyways, we should probably go and actually hunt. Should. Yeah, and so our motley crew decides to head off into the woods. But should we roll to actually find an animal? Uh, it would be uh, either investigation or perception. Uh, okay, so perception. The better you roll, the better the animal you find. I'm doing perception. I'm doing perception. How about survival? Survival would also work. I'm doing perception. It's better. Man, if you guys Ten. took Petra with you, you would have gotten a plus six to the survivals. <laughs> yeah, I want I want them to roll badly oh! the first time. <laughs> well, they learn of their about mistakes. About that. Well, <laughs> all right. So uh, I'm gonna say that uh, you look around and uh, you you don't see fucking shit, nor. That was a seventeen. No, I'm no, I. You, that's you me. Got a D twenty minus four for some reason. No, that's me. I have a D twenty oh. plus four. Oh. Okay. Yeah, it's D that one, okay. and then the two rows below that. Okay, so you you look around and you're just like, wow, this sure is a forest. And you're like, you see the average amount of things, but you figure that, like, uh, uh, any amount of squirrels won't make a very good jacket. Yeah. Yeah. And they're just sort of wandering around being squirrels, and you're just like, I don't see anything bigger than that. But then, uh, Star, you immediately, you're just like, bum ba dum ba dum ba dum you're looking around, and you make immediate eye contact with something large and growling. <laughs> I, I think because Star is still sitting on March's hat, I think their vantage point is why they can like see, yeah, uh, see it. <laughs> Star, yeah. you're facing directly into the woods, and uh, March is facing away from the woods towards the town. <laughs> yeah, I think um, Star's gonna pat the top of like March's hat with the um, you should you should pay attention to this. Mm -hmm. My yeah, and uh, Nora, you got a seventeen. So uh, you you saw at the same time <laughs> that uh, Star did. You you were looking in the same direction, and you're just like, um, and you you <laughs> gently tug, like just like, uh. What what is this thing, by the way, that's growling and looking at you? Uh, it depends on uh how how bad I want to make this fight. Uh, what is your guys' level again? Uh, four. 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 Alright, your guys' level is four, which means, uh, hold on. Uh, I, do not like I want to see if I can make well. it an owl bear. That's too high. No, <laughs> don't, don't make it an owl bear. Holy shit. I'm no. looking it up. I'm looking it up for you, Al. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm looking up right now. Is uh. It'd be really cool if it were an owl bear. Or once again, uh, I'm not allowed to use any of my fire, aren't I? It's challenge rating three, so it should be good. Yeah, that should be fine, actually. All right, so you guys, you guys turn your heads. You see it. You see the big, the terrifying, the shiny eyes that reflect light back to you of an oh. owl bear. Oh, good. Oh, fun. <laughs> big. Uh, yeah, um, Star has gotten off of, uh, March's hat and has pulled out their umbrella. March is gonna take a fighting stance. Star is gonna go uh, I'm gonna say to this is the perfect time for, uh, Petra to, uh, wander into the woods. Like, okay, <laughs> is anyone dead? <laughs> did March, did, well, would Petra have to sneak away from Kami? This whole time. <laughs> oh, Petra's got, uh, Petra's nails are now painted. <gasps> yes. Good. <laughs> and, uh, Petra has had breakfast. Good, yes. <laughs> Wonderful. <laughs> also, so many fucking braids. Yes! Yes! <laughs> oh, that actually does Little plastic me. butterfly clips, too, you know, like, from, uh, the early 2000s? Yes, oh, good. Yes. 
good. Very good. So basically, you're covered in like kitschy like accessories, and you've got uh, your nails have been painted. Uh, what's a good color for Petra? Um, I usually default to gold or green for Petra. All right, then uh, it's like a, a pretty like lime green with sparkles in it. Nice. <laughs> Because it's hard to see the sparkles in gold. Uh, mm -hmm. And then uh, you're just like, all right, is everyone okay? And you kind of look like you stumbled ass first into Eclairs. <laughs> Man, I Petra would not have had time to put on armor, so Petra does not have armor. Okay. Yeah, you, I think you get, I don't know if it would have been much use, but like a person shushing themselves from stuff. <laughs> Uh, and I'm gonna say, uh, because of that, uh, the owl bearer hears you, turns around, sees all the shiny shit, and is just like, oh god, oh, the light no. is reflecting off of it. <laughs> uh, and can you guys all roll for initiative? <laughs> oh yes, I'm so looking forward to this. Thirteen. from Petra. <laughs> uh, Al, you broke up this one. Yeah, I forgot there the exhibition. Go. There we go. Oh. Okay, so... <laughs> Alright, so we so far got March. Uh, I'm gonna say the owl bear, then Petra, then Star. Yeah. Oh, the owl bear would actually go after Petra, because it has a lower initiative modifier. Oh, it does! Yeah, thank you so much. So it would be uh, March... Petra, Owlbear, Nor, and Star. Yeah, yeah. Thank you so much for putting the the the, the thing in there. So, uh, March, what do you what do you want to do? What do what I want to do? This bear is very big. It is very big, and you know what? March is like, wow, this is, thing's really big. I'm gonna have to hit it really, really hard if we're gonna get the leather from this thing. So, <laughs> March is so March is just gonna uh. Is yeah. it like a bird skin or is it like a bear skin? You'll never know. About to find out. About to find find out, I guess. Yeah, he's just gonna. He's just gonna. Uh, yeah, he's gonna run forward and uh, clock this thing with a big with a big uh, uppercut. Uh, okay, so you're gonna want to roll to roll the hit. Yep. Yep. Uh, where's my unarmed fighting? There it is. Ah. Uh, that will not do it. Uh, you try to clock it, but this thing is fluffy, like with fur and feathers, and you didn't know that was a thing. Well, at least I could do. Well, uh, uh, the nice thing is, is that I do have a bonus action for to do another to do another yeah, strike. Like your so your first arm sinks into this floop, and it's very soft, actually. Oh, you're very fluffy. Kind of sorry, I've got to do this. Yeah, the thing growls. Twenty one. Uh, that'll do it. Uh, you you hit with the other arm. Roll me some damage. E, which I believe is still, thanks to being a class and fighter, it's a D8 instead of a D4. Yay me. Da -la 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 -la. I think I did that right. Oh. Yep, uh, and you do eight points of damage, so you, you have your first arm deep in the fluff of this thing, and it like it's rearing back, and its, sh its beak is razor sharp, and it's got huge claws, uh, and this thing will kill you. And um, you just sort of like, oh... Oh, Punch. oh, and then you slam, you, you hit it up the chin, and uh, you hear the beak clack together, uh, and uh, you do eight points of damage. The thing rears back, uh, like, does the classic horse, like, like where the, the legs went to the hill, uh -huh. and then lands, and the ground shakes when it lands. Oh. Nice, 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 nice. <laughs> Guys, this thing is awesome. It is. <laughs> but it's also trying to kill us. Oh, yeah. It lets out a horrific, uh, inhuman screech. Oh, great. <laughs> is it Petra's turn? Uh, yes, it is Petra's turn, so. Cool. I'm do? first in rolling hammer space. <laughs> oh, no! That's a fumble. It's a fumble! It's time for us to see what she pulls out! That's a five? Or, Petra, what do you... 
Pulls out what looks like a music box. It's made out of rocks. Uh, and she's like, oh, that's not it. Oh, peck. <laughs> it comes out playing like a, a soothing tone, like just very bum ba dum ba dum bum 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 smooth jazz. And uh, and I'm gonna say uh, this would be. Uh, the owl bear hears this, and its ears twitch, and then it screams at the box. <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna shove it into her pocket and then reach in the hammer space again because she needs her weapon. She needs her weapon. Uh, that, that works. Makes okay, war hammer has been brought out. Uh, Kutcha is going to, uh, hmm. I think actually she's gonna stay put where she is and cast Guiding Bolt at this thing. So I'm gonna roll a ranged spell attack, which for Petra is a. Hey, actually, wait. I have, I have a while before it's my turn again, so I'm gonna be right back in the bathroom. Six. Okay. This is the attack. <laughs> Jesus! That'll do it. Uh, you, you rear back with your warhammer and you're like, shit, 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 because this thing is clearly about to charge you and it, it, it is aiming for your vital mm -hmm. regions. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And okay, so, so Petra has cast Guiding Bolt, which is gonna do 13 radiant damage. Oh. Okay, so that's 13 plus uh, 8, I think. Yeah, 13 plus 8, uh, plus which eight. is 20 From March's so. attack. Yeah, this ah, is okay. just, uh, yeah, this is just me doing some math and also Got it. Okay. cursing 21. the fact that I don't have a goddamn pencil. 21 um, to mm -hmm. total. Yeah, 21 mm -hmm. damage. Okay. I know, I just, I have to do mental math over mm -hmm. here. Yep. There okay. we go. And then a part of guarding, Guiding Bolt is that uh, the target takes 46 radiant damage, and the next attack roll made against this target before the end of your next turn has advantage. So whoever hits this thing next, you're going to have an easier time doing it. <laughs> okay, so uh, this, this creature has been smushed, and you definitely gave it some sort of concussion, which means it's very <laughs> pissed, and it's about mm. to try to attack you back. So okay. uh, this right. is going to be... Okay, I got to do math for Petra's AC currently because it's a lot lower than usual. <laughs> oh. That doesn't hit. <laughs> oh, oh, that does. No. Yeah, uh, it snaps at you with its beak, but like, uh, you, you dance out of the way. But then you don't take into account uh, bears have really long arms. <laughs> and long claws. Yep. So uh, you're like, ah, oh, I'm out of range, and then a giant hand hits you in the midsection, and you take... Oh. You take 16 points of slashing damage. <laughs> you are knocked, like, through the air because smack, and you, uh, blood goes flying, uh, and you, you, you conk into a tree. Oof. Ow. Oh. Ow. This yeah. thing screeches again, uh, and you see the sort of like bloodthirsty like look in its eye, or at least it's not bloodthirsty, but when when you've just been hit by it, it probably seems a little bloodthirsty. Yeah, yeah. I feel like Petra like against the tree is like rubbing her <laughs> like dragging like a hand across her face, like, okay, all right, we're getting serious. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and uh, cracks her knuckles. <laughs> Yeah, the the owl bear continues like uh like it it strides forward and it makes to like uh I've gotten the first blood in and now I'm going to eat this thing. Mm. Okay. Cool. Oh boy. Is that the end of its turn or? Uh, that's the end of its turn because I did multi attack, so uh it missed mm -hmm. the beak and then it got the one with the claws and that took a fair amount of your HP. Sure did. Yep. <laughs> All right, so the next person in uh, line is Noir. Uh, it is it Noir. is Nor. So Nor. Uh, is the owl bear near him? Cause uh, he was behind Petra and March when this all went down. 
Uh, I'm going to say that you, you managed to get out of the way once it hit Petra uh, into the tree. And now you are between March and this creature. Right, and the creature's going for Petra, right? He's not Yes, being... so, like, you're a little bit to the right. Okay, so, um... Ah, nor, nor, like, you, Petra and March actually see his hands part for a moment, but then he's like, Step back. Step fire mount it. You're also, you're in the, you're in a forest, so setting a fire would be bad. Yeah, that, that part, like, comes later, where he's like, oh yeah, I don't want to burn down the entire forest. Yeah, okay, so I'm just- uh, I'm, I'm over here, like, maybe don't set a fire. Okay, so instead he's gonna cast a uh, Minor Illusion. Alright, what, what are you trying to do, bud? So he's gonna make, like, a very, like, loud roaring noise. And Ooh. he's going to make it, like, come from Petra. Yeah! <laughs> uh, okay, so you're gonna have to roll performance for that. Uh, no, actually, the old bear has to roll an intelligence investigation check against my spell save. Oh, uh, so, I'm like, would that be perception or intelligence? I don't remember. Intelligence. Probably straight intelligence. Yeah. Yep. Alright. So, also, uh, hi, Fable, are you back? E. Finally, e. a creature with a, yeah. a bad enough, uh, roll to compete with your dex. <laughs> okay! Oh. That's that's uh that's a ugly one. So uh, uh yeah, the creature no. is just like, oh oh like like it thinks that uh Petra has been doing the roaring, like uh and immediately backs up a little bit, uh so like this gives you an extra few seconds. So okay, that's my good deed for the day, and he's gonna um look at. Like, he's gonna move back 30 feet away, so the old bear's not up to <laughs> I'm just gonna move 30 feet away! <laughs> Bye. Boy, howdy. <laughs> um, uh, it's Star's turn now, I guess. Um, so, um, seeing Te Petra take that hit, um, uh, Star's gonna gonna rage, and then yeah. he's gonna <laughs> gonna run in and uh and like to to hit this um hit this owlbear with with their um their umbrella. All right, so I'm gonna need you to roll to hit. Yep, yep. Just uh just need to double check. It's been a. You also have bit advantage about... because of oh, the yeah. Nice, nice. Um. Uh, it's damage bonus. Okay, just wanted to double check because it's uh, mm -hmm. the, what the rage gave. Fable, angry face. <laughs> well, uh, with um, advantage, that's a 24. Alright, so uh, that means that yes, you do hit. Can you roll me some damage? You yes, gotta roll to get a tacky tack. Star just fucking slides in on his knees with his umbrella like I'm fucking pissed. Kirby's fucking pissed. Uh, seven damage. That does seven damage. So, um, <laughs> an umbrella isn't the best blunt choice weapon against a creature that's like three times your size. It's not the best, but you do do some damage. You poke it in the eye. Poke. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Take Man, that. this is going really well. Yeah, and it, it backs up, and uh, it, like, it, like, again, it rears back, and then it, like, scoots back, because, like, this thing just yelled at it, and now one of its eyes hurts, and now it's sort of just, like, bap, 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 and stepping backwards. Yeah, so now it is, I need to check the order again. I think it's March's turn? Yeah, I think it's March's turn. Cool. Yep, it's March's turn. Cool, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna, do, I'm gonna spend two of my bonus action stuff. Uh, March is gonna keep within, uh, uh, is gonna keep within five feet of this thing with his movement, and he's going to summon his arms of astral self. So if this thing could make a dex save. All right, dex save uh, is. Plus 
God damn it. Okay, so okay. Yeah, so you get no yeah, you get no damage from the arms uh, uh from the extra inky arms, but I'm going to spend a key point to do flurry of blows. All right, nice. Wait, quick question. Doesn't the arms of Astral Self need up a bonus action? Flurry of blows also requires a bonus action. But I can use one of them as an action if I want to. Yeah, and uh he did just eat a key point. Yeah, and I now you yeah, it's just our uh summoning the arms does not cost a key point, uh but flurry of blows does. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Yeah, yeah, I checked. I did double- yeah. Thank you for asking, I did double check, I swear. But anyways. Yeah, I've played a month, so I'm like, no, this sounds reasonable. Wait, so anyways. Wait, Flurry of Blows can only activate if you've taken an attack action, though. So if you use your action to summon your arms, that doesn't count as an attack. What? What? Yeah, Flurry of Blows can only be used after you take an attack action. The attack doesn't have to hit, but you have to take the action. I mean, the arms- summoning the arms, since it does damage, is technically- wouldn't that count? Yeah. No, it's it, like it rolling just, to hit. Like it's it's uh it's a move that can cause damage. Uh, I think uh that you you summoned it, but the bear dodged is what that was. So uh mm -hmm. it technically didn't do any attack damage. So like, however, you can still try to punch someone a bunch. Yeah. After. Yeah. Yeah. I'm Sorry, just gonna just... say like uh if we're really worried about it, burn another key point. I'm bur wait, so I'm burning two key points? Yes. <sighs> Reach deep inside of yourself and burn your key points. I mean, that doesn't... Okay, fine. I'm sorry, You'll people. get them back! Yeah, but, like, that makes no s That... <sighs> Whatever. I'm Anyways. Sorry, I could agree with Fable on that. Yeah, that's... Yeah, it's, it's that weird wording where it's like, oh, if you don't take an attack action, like... Even if you do, like, Look, I, I'm not on. that anal about this. I just don't want anyone to be like, oh, you're giving special. I, I'm not. Just fucking flurry of blows well, this thing, man. I don't. I don't. Um, like, honestly, if you want to, like, still do the flurry of blows with one key point, I'm done with it. It was just. I wanted to. I do remember that I. Like, I did remember that flurry of blows is like that. I'm gonna hit this thing now. So. Yes, please do. <laughs> Uh, and I get two. I get two hits because it's flurry of blows. So, mm -hmm. does a ten hit? No. Does a sixteen hit? That hits. Okay. Bunker. Huh? Smacker. I believe it's. Uh, Attack you with a hammer. Smashing you with a rock. Now I'm gonna I'm gonna pass this by you, Al, real quick because flurry of blows. While it does say one d four damage, because I'm a fighter, all my unarmed strikes become one d eight damage when I'm not holding a weapon. No, that's fair. You don't have a weapon in your arms, uh, and usually you're usually you're either gonna punch something directly, or you've got like a stick or whatever. You yeah. do not have to stick out, so I'm gonna say it's one d eight. Okay, I'm double checking that with you. Okay, yeah, one d eight plus three, nine damage. Okay, so that's uh, there we go. Uh, and uh, you you hit it again. And you're you're leaving like splotches of uh, dark ink on this uh, this creature, uh, and uh, it is it's looking a little like bloodied and beat to hell. And uh, uh, it is now officially like run out of rage because like uh, I'm just gonna say uh, when when you're a creature who lives in the woods and you're looking for a meal, you're not gonna go for the thing that keeps trying to eat, eat like that's genuinely better at you in a fight. You're gonna try and get away. So, uh, this creature is like, alright, fuck it, I'm out, bye! So does that leave... Oh, but it doesn't, it's not its turn yet to move. It's not, so it's basically, it's backing up, now it is Petra's turn. Cool! Bonus action healing word on herself. <laughs> Cause, ow! Yeah, what's the, ow. what's the healing word that you pick? Ow? Ow. Oh. That's not a word, that's a gonna, sound of pain. I was actually gonna go with damnation. <laughs> there we go. Okay, you, say, <laughs> you say your healing word. Damnation! <laughs> and your wounds begin to knit. Uh, so mm. you need to roll to see how much you get back there. Yeah, so it's the d4 plus the spellcasting modifier. And then, because Petra's a life clerk, it actually, I found out it actually does bonus healing fuck yeah oh but that's the minimum <laughs> oh. 
Uh, oh. you get you get eight points back, so you get about half of what this bear took. So I'm gonna say that the the bleeding staunches and uh, mm -hmm. you you get scabs where the where the wounds were. So like it's closed up, but that hurts. Mm -hmm. And if you move weird, it's gonna fuck up, and you're gonna tear it open. That's fine. That's fair. <laughs> Petra is angry. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> and like you. It just, she's just gonna go charging in. <laughs> Petra rushes in. Petra rushes in. <laughs> gonna make an attack with her warhammer. <laughs> That's an eight. Nope. <laughs> that ain't gonna do it. You you swing, that but that you don't do it. Again, you you pull something, and you're like, oh son of a bitch, that hurt. Yeah. <laughs> you just hear dwarfish swear words. Yeah, and like a little bit of red splatters against the dirt. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and next it's the owl bear's uh, turn, and the owl bear is looking like bloodied, and everyone's pissed at it. And this is not an easy meal of adventurers. <laughs> it figured Red's it would be an easy meal. It. Nor isn't pissed at it. He's like gone. Like he's like thirty feet back. He's like he's hiding, man. The, oh all god! Three very uh, angry the the owl bear right then like face. sprints forward out of the woods. Like and so attack of opportunity. <laughs> yes, you do get an attack of opportunity, but it's it sprints past you, uh, and it also um, just like its head is facing like down, so it's not looking where it's going. Uh, nor you are swept up onto this thing's head. <laughs> hey, what? <laughs> you guys just hear that before? I'm like, no, 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 no. Hold on a second. Owl, you should let Nor make. A deck saving throw. Yeah. I wanted to be nice. Oh, okay. Oh, bitch. I wanted to be nice, but all right. Uh, hey. Cool. Roll deck. Oh. <laughs> I think. Why don't everyone roll their damage first? Yeah. Every. <laughs> no, 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 no. Roll deck first. Roll deck first. Yeah. No. Roll deck because this thing runs past you and is about to slam into you, and you're about to get swept up onto its head. So. I am so sorry for you. Oh, that's actually good. <laughs> that's pretty good. Uh, you you manage to uh, you avoid the beak and you basically just grab it like you're holding on like fistfuls of feathers and you're like son of a bitch. Uh, so Petra and March, uh, what are your attacks? Those are I'm pretty sure all three of them hit. Yeah, no, they do. That's why I'm asking. Roll damage. Oh yeah. Okay, let's let's go one at a time. Uh, okay, I'll go. I'll... Specifically used two-handed, so it does a bit more extra damage for her whip. Yeah, March just doing his usual punch. Another hit with the. Ah, that's four. Oh. It's not that good. Okay, so twelve, four, and ten. That would be twenty-two, twenty-six points of damage, which will do it. Uh, Petra, you, you slam up your hammer under its, uh, you slam its hammer, you you slam your hammer into one of its legs, uh, March, you, you grab hold of the other leg and you yank, and then, uh, Star, you, um, uh, you, you take your, what are you attacking with, Star? Um, his, his umbrella. Alright, you take the umbrella, and, uh, then you basically, uh, you... You hit it like right behind the head. Like you basically you pistol whip this thing with your umbrella. <laughs> and uh it 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 dies. Like uh it all the brain damage and all of the, the skull <laughs> fractures. Oof. Uh it um it it dies, but like <laughs> Nor, you're still holding on to the front of its head, and inertia says that an object in motion must stay in motion till stopped by an outside force. Are you saying so, that I have to make another deck save? No, I'm saying that you're you're holding onto its head. It crashes into the ground, uh, and you uh, it flips sort of like ass over tea kettle, and you are now underneath this dead bear. <laughs> okay, let me make something real quick. You have one foot sticking out. <laughs> he's fine. He's fine. You hear him wheeze from under the old bear, but like he's not unconscious or anything. <laughs> Congratulations! Uh, you, you 
solved my my leather puzzle. And he helped Petra you. Just goes, Petra just goes, nice, and raises a hand up for high five, six star, and March. March immediately yep. goes yep. for it, because that was <laughs> awesome. Yeah, definitely, definitely the instinctual high five. And then Petra's gonna run over and get the bear off of poor Nor. Yeah, March will also come over to help with that. Yeah, yeah, and stop. Do it. Are we rolling strength for this, or do you think between the three of us we can get it off of them? No, you guys are all strength-based characters. I think it's fine if all three of you are working together. You live. Nice. And uh, I'm gonna say, uh, Petra, since you're still wounded, you don't help, like, lift it, but you pull Nor out by the feet. Uh, uh. Hey, Nor, we got you leather. Thanks. <laughs> it's a lot of leather. Right? You alright? Yeah. No injuries or anything? And like, Petra's like checking you over real fast. I'm fine. What about you? That thing got you in a car. No, don't worry. I'm fine. And Petra casts cure wounds on herself? <laughs> of uh, you're gonna have I to roll your shit. Me. I know, I'm doing it, I'm doing it. And that's at first level, so... Boop. Eleven. Uh, alright, yeah, that brings you back to full health. So, uh, your wounds knit together and you have a healthy glow about you, like... Like, you've just spent time resting in the sun, and you just, it, you feel good. However, you're also stained with blood and your shirt is ripped. Good thing we're going to the tailor. Also, uh, all the fun, like, shit in your hair, like, some of it's fallen out, you look messy. Your nails are not broken, you did chip a bunch of the polish. Eh, well. Oh, and the guts and meat of this thing will make for it's good okay. food. We can, we can rebuild. We can rebuild. <laughs> we can make we it stronger. We probably get yep. out of here before more things come out and go over. Yeah. It's right. definitely getting a nod from Star. To the town! Uh, so you guys drag the enormous corpse of this owl bear into the town plaza. Mm -hmm. And, uh, uh, what's the child been doing this whole time? Um... <laughs> they they were um, petting the rabbit. They were going around to different people in town and showing their new friend <laughs> to Aww. everybody. Aww. Chide my boo I'm oh, just picturing like it just, like cutting back and forth between the four and the woods, like <laughs> desperately fighting for their lives, <laughs> and the child just like wandering up. Look at look at my new friend. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Child has been looking for them to show off the new friend also. Yeah. Oh. You hear the, the hubbub of three very strong people dragging 400 pounds of meat into the town square. <laughs> slid. 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 Uh, upon seeing the child, March is actually kind of kind of hide a little bit behind the bulk of bear, owl bear that he's carrying. Just like, oh, shit. Um, uh, uh, and, uh, I need you to roll intelligence to, or wisdom to see how well you deal with this. Okay, what? I guess. Um. Wait, the child or me? You, because, like, I want to see what excuse that you come up with. Oh, Mart? Oh. Yeah, like, Wait, what? I want to see, like, March is just like, oh god, there's a child, what do I tell him about the horrible inevitability of death? Oh, that's not why March is hiding. <laughs> why the fuck is March hiding? Cause, 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 uh, during, okay, so, uh, uh, March and child had an FPS and it didn't end super great and March still feels kind of bad about how it ended. So he's worried oh, that the ch he's worried about the dead creature you were dragging in the town in front of the kid. No, he's worried that the kid is may might be upset with him, so he's hiding. Oh, okay, well, then that would be like a uh, child. Can you roll me perception? Oh, sure. Um... Or just hide behind like Petra. <laughs> <laughs> if this thing goes well. Very oh, funny. <laughs> you see him immediately. <laughs> The child runs up to the group to show off the bunny. <laughs> Aww. And no comment on the big dead bear? Alright. Nope. Uh, <laughs> nope. Like, just like, oh, that's where my bunny went. <laughs> Why is this little guy again? And like, Petra points to the rabbit. <laughs> March is just hiding. 
Yeah, not I well, think, but he's hiding. I think, um, I think Star is going to, oh uh, god, how, how is Star going to, um, Star, like, begins by forming the, the name of the bunny to let, uh, the, the child know what it is, and then is like, ah, hmm, can the, the child, can they read? No. Nope. Haven't learned yet. Uh, that's what the translate. school's gonna be for. I can translate for you. <laughs> That's yeah, right. you I... can't read great either, though. Can't well, what? Marge peeks out and says, and will very quickly translate before hiding again. Yeah, you, you get the, the 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 bunny's name is Asteria, but it also goes by Skippy. But his name is Asteria. You can call it Skippy. Skippy. Okay, but is the easier one. Marge goes back to hiding. Actually, I think he's got to quickly, like, oh, hey, I should probably go take this to someone. Okay, bye. And Marge is going to try and carry the owlbear off. Yeah, and uh, Kami comes out of the tailor shop like, oh my god, this is the best present ever! <laughs> yeah. We killed just a bear. Im immediately, like, burying uh, her whole face in it, just like, oh, yes, this is going to make so many good jackets. Oh, I can't wait to take <laughs> this thing apart. <laughs> okay. Have you ever been around a person who, like, loves doing a craft and then you just gave them, like, a ton of supplies? March is, uh, learning. Given that it was, like, uh, it was at one point a living creature, that makes this a little more macabre, but, like, I'm, I'm trying to get across the, like, the sense of joy of... Oh, I just got like 700 new like balls of yarn and I want to make sweaters. I think Nora actually looks over the old bear and it's just like conversationally like, Oh man, this meat's gonna feed a lot of people. Yeah, like the whole thing is like, this is gonna make a really cool amount of out like outfits, the bones and stuff are gonna be really helpful for like future leather endeavors. Every part of this owl bear is going to be used, every part of it is going to be respected, uh, and I'm pretty Isn't sure every part thing? of it's gonna be eaten. We do not have picky eaters. Isn't nah. it a thing where, like, isn't it a thing where bones make very good, like, I don't remember what the- Yeah, the bones make really called. good leather tanning hides yeah, materials. Mm -hmm. They- they work the best out of, uh, metal, plastic, or, uh, wood. Mm -hmm. They just- they get better with time. So, it's one of those things where, like, uh, Kami is just like, okay, I'm going to, uh, I'm gonna take care of these materials, and then I'm gonna give the- rest of the like and then Noctis is like I am helping and he goes uh like they they take the basically they, they take everything and they like uh head off to like a designated area where you can like do butchery and shit mm -hmm. wait not this way I wanna okay what do you want hey 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 what's up what do you want uh could have March pulls out the four gold coin that Star gave him earlier in the day can I buy something real quick uh, yeah, sure. Uh, Kami, can you handle this? And, uh, Kami's just like, I need a wagon first, but yes. Uh, I can go get that for you real quick. <laughs> Thank you! Petra runs off to go grab that. <laughs> yeah, so, uh, Come Noctis back. then- Noctis, Noctis takes, uh, uh, March into the store and is just like, uh, alright, what did you- what do you want? Painting kit. Uh, kids, adults, or the fucked up multi tool kit? Uh, kids. Alright, and he reaches under the counter and he pulls out uh, a nice, it's a 24 set. Uh, it has one brush with it. Uh, it's made out of, like, uh, out of wood. The whole thing is, like, carved. Uh, the, the thing that's holding the paints is made out of some type of stone. Uh, and, uh, or metal. It, it doesn't really matter, but, like, uh, pulls it out slides it forward and says uh you're not gonna get much use out of it without this and uh he pulls up a small pack of uh of paper like it's it's got a little like binding at the top sort of like college ruled type thing where you can flip the pages uh and slides it across the counter i'll give you to that i'll give you this for no charge considering that you literally have just like provided a large amount of materials for the community it's it's real great you help the town i help you March's eyes are sparkly, and he hands over the gold, and, uh, will very carefully take both the painting kit and the papers. He, he's holding the papers between his fingers, because he doesn't want his palms to touch it. 
Yeah, uh, and Noctis uh, just says, do you want me to wrap that for you, or...? Yes, please. Alright, uh, and he, he pulls out a nice, uh, it's, it's a sheaf of paper, uh, it, it's wrapping paper, it's got, uh, it's got print on it. Uh, what do you guys want it to be printed with? Uh... Little chickens. Alright, it's, chickens. it's printed with little chicks, like, uh, <laughs> little yellow chicks. Oh, March, March got big sparkly eyes. Yeah, but... And, uh, Noctis also has a bright red ribbon, and, uh, he, he ties it up, up at the top, uh, tightens it up, and then says, here you go. March very carefully takes them. Thank you. And then March is, uh, immediately gonna dash out the door and look for the kid. Yeah, uh, Noctis waves, and then he heads out the door and then goes to help, uh, with, uh, Kami's... Uh, mission. So basically, uh, this owl bear is being taken apart into uh, pieces. Uh, everything's being uh, saved, and you're gonna have a lot of owl bear jerky. Uh, basically, <laughs> we are showing this creature the respect it deserves. We are using it properly, uh, and mm -hmm. uh, we're not hunting a million of them. We just need enough for like materials. Mm -hmm. yeah. So just sustainable hunting, <laughs> respectful hunting. You want to be. A good person about it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. Because like everything eats everything else. That's how nature works. But you don't doing. see people like just like fucking eating something and then leaving all of it. That's that's the fucked mm. up part. It's a dick move, yeah. is what it is. Yep. Yeah. So uh, I'm gonna say that uh, Star. Uh, all right. Uh, Uni, would the child have given the Star back his money? Hold on. Um. Am I wrong they... that? <laughs> the the child uh it, it, they're they're not going to like keep the bunny away from Star, but they do want to play with it a little bit longer. That's yeah. Uh, I think um I think with that, like Star actually um can see how much the child really like likes the bunny and is gonna be like not going to ask for the bunny back. No. And I think, yeah, they they've just been like really excited to to show to share their new friend uh, to everybody. Yeah, <laughs> and... I think I think what Star has been doing though is been sort of like uh like softly like leading the child and like being like this is how you hold it and uh this is what it eats and uh this is how you can pet it and it re she really likes the little scratches under the chin and uh like just those little like gentle uh pointers mm -hmm. yeah very good so i think i think probably march comes back to like the two of them having their very silent uh instruction <laughs> lesson <laughs> yeah, March's shadow just kind of looms over them for a second, and he's, um, uh, hi. Oh, hey, you, blinks you up get a wave. Them. March just very awkwardly holds out the, the, the wrapped, uh, the wrapped gift to the, to the, to the kid. They stare. <laughs> March stares back. Just holding it out. Blink, motherfucker. <laughs> the child, like, they kind of wait for a second and then look at Star and, like, for you? <laughs> uh, I, I think Star is going to gesture like a no, um, and like a it, it's for you like a little go, go get it. Very hesitantly they take it and stare at it. It, uh... You think, uh, you looked like you like to draw, and I thought, uh... Sorry about before, and, uh... Hope you like it. Okay, bye. And Mark's just gonna walk away! <laughs> uh, hold on. <laughs> child, child will, um grab onto Barge's pant leg before he could get too far away. Ah. Uh, okay. March stops. 
child holds up the bunny to march. Bunny. That's very bunny. cute. March will very carefully hold up a finger towards Bunny. Yeah, and child knows that, you know, with with all the goofy Inky and the Bunny, probably not a great combo to yeah. do the touching, but <laughs> they wanted to make sure that March got to say hello. By the way, March can roll an insight on Star if he would like. Yeah, all right. It's my insight again. It's, my insight's actually pretty good. Thank God. It's 11. <laughs> um, no, that's not enough. There's, um, the, I will say the star looks like very, like, it, fond uh, at the child with the bunny uh, and a little bit wistful. That's all you get. Aww. Mm. And once, once child is satisfied that uh, March and the bunny have have greeted one another, they will um, smile at him and then uh, um, go back over to Star. <laughs> <laughs> and March will, uh... yeah, he'll 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 leave them be. But yeah, child, you now have a uh, you now have a little painter's kit. Mm-hmm. With some paper with it too. Mm-hmm. I think Petra is gonna eventually rejoin this group, <laughs> kind of like I... sliding up behind where March was. <laughs> I'm I'm actually wondering, would it be possible for them to be setting up a little area for the the bunny to like live, uh, like a little uh... outdoor cage thing? Oh, to, a bunny like... hutch. Yeah. yeah. A bunny hutch. Yes, that's, that's be... perfectly, like, yes. Basically, uh, Noctis has a small garden next to his shop, so I'm gonna say that uh, next to the garden, you set up, like, a little bunny hutch. Aww. Bunny. Yeah, uh, it also has, like, a little, like, cat door into, uh, like, Noctis's house, so, like, when it's really mm-hmm. cold, the bunny can go inside. What? Mm-hmm. Very cute. Yeah. <laughs> so there we go. All right, uh, Grem. <laughs> yeah, so fucking sorry. Uh, Grem. Don't worry about it. Grem has been vibing the entire time. Uh, Grem, you're just sort of vibing, and all of a sudden, a cart full of an entire owl bear <laughs> is dragged into your space, and uh, Kami. Noctis and Petra are all talking very loudly about uh, oh, yeah, how they're yeah. going to like make sure all of this gets like used properly. And then Noctis sees Grem and is just like, "Oh hey, hey, hey you, what's up?" Aw, uh, hey, I was doing some maths. <laughs> you want to help us? <laughs> Grem looks back at the dead old bear. <laughs> Mm. Thanks. Uh, can you please roll Arcana for me? Oh god. Ooh. What kind oh. of Arcana check? I think it's... Oh gosh, I don't know. <laughs> Hold on, I'm looking at the warrior. It's really <laughs> high for- I know for a fact that yeah, Grem has bullshit like Hamlet. Right? Oh, come on, Grem. <laughs> this is literally your job. Oh, buddy. Graham is too tired for this shit. They have been counting stuff about their shop all day, cleaning up. I'm More. gonna say that uh, with that, you don't know what it is, but you do get a whiff of, like, a curse. Uh-huh. Ooh. Immediately Graham interested. Graham suddenly, like, Graham, Graham originally, I sleep. Graham immediately. <laughs> Real <I> shit? <laughs> You get like a whiff of a curse, like like when you walk into a place and you smell vanilla, but you're not sure where it's coming from. <laughs> it's exactly the same thing. Obviously, uh, it's coming from the owl bear. So immediately you sort of perk up and you drop uh, a bunch of the papers you're holding or whatever. Graham, you <laughs> there, buddy? stuffs them back in the bag. <laughs> okay. Um. What's up? 
Imagine Hi, being way we more just want hunting. Now. Not that you are here to help. <laughs> or oh, I it. would have been a dead weight. Don't worry about that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh my gosh. I sure bet you would have uh, been. <laughs> hey. Oh my goodness. Only I get to say stuff like this about myself. <laughs> I'm just agreeing with you. <laughs> uh, uh, do you guys have this all handled? <laughs> Click yeah, just... you, you you can head out. Uh, and yeah. uh, Grim, basically, like you you're like, oh, hey, this this thing is cursed. This thing's got a curse on it. <laughs> this thing's cursed as shit. <laughs> Okay, should I roll investigation on the thing? <laughs> yeah, please do. Wait, mm. before before Petra goes, I think Petra just goes to pat Grim on the shoulder and cast enhance ability. <laughs> <laughs> you got uh Fox's cunning. You get advantage on intelligence checks. There you go. There we Thank go. Thank you very much. You are too nice to me. I love you. <laughs> I love you too. All right. And... There we go. That'll do it. Mm -hmm. It's the same for investigation in Arcana, so everything's fine. What uh, do I get? Okay, so uh, you you look inside and you're like, oh hey, yeah, yeah. there's there's definitely something cursed in there, and uh, <laughs> it's one of those things where you can tell that it's inside of the owl bear. Uh huh. Great. So, do you, how do you want to? How do you want to get that out? Would you like to tell anyone about the curse first? Oh, uh, not yet, because Graham is still looking at it and trying to figure out. They're they're in deep, man. You don't you don't know them when they're thinking about curses. Fair enough. Okay, is there a way to open up this thing? Yes, it's called a knife. Great, can you do that? Wow. Um, uh, Kami then uh, just is like, alright, and then uses her extremely good knowledge of how to open a creature. I do not remember what the word is in English, but I know the word in French about opening up a dead animal. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's dissection. So she begins, yeah, she yeah. begins uh dissecting it, pulling it apart so that like it Cuts does the least the amount family. of damage to the hide and the in internals. And like they already set up like a drop cloth and all that other stuff, so we're we're good here. Okay. Uh and uh that's when uh she starts like cutting into it. Mm -hmm. And uh on the inside there's an egg. Oh fun. But it's, it's I know not, about like, eggs. this creature is clearly, it's male. Yeah. Hmm. Do I know anything about egg? <laughs> uh, the thing that you know about the egg is that, like, uh, owl bears don't lay eggs. They give birth to live young. Can, okay, okay cool. do the others see the egg? Can Nor roll something about the egg? Alright, uh, Nor, you would, you would notice that this is just, like, how much do you know about birds? A lot. <laughs> Alright, how much do you know about magical birds? A lot. Okay, so uh you you know that this is um this is uh the type of egg that comes from like uh a a rebirth. Like uh, oh. a sort of like a reincarnation type deal. Well, okay, cool. um Hello? Gonna, anyone roll perception? Um Lord just bit through his cigarette. Oh god. Wait, do we have to roll perception or that or not? <laughs> no, you can if you want it. Say to the Meg. Oh, you you don't have to. Hmm. Or it's just like Um Okay, that's an egg. Yes it is. Great sure thing is you an have egg. Eyes. Uh, it's a big egg. It's about the size of like uh I'm gonna say it's about the size of Nor, give or take. What? Big. Most of the inside of this creature is egg. That's oh, terrifying. Oh. 
That's good on that. Uh, I'd wager an opinion and say this X from, um, and he just rattles off what all of us give me that is probably from a magical creature. And yeah, it's specifically it's me. that, uh, uh, it's the, the, the owl bear outside of this is, uh, actually the curse itself. And, uh, this was, uh, the eventual, like, basically, uh, if, if you're familiar with, like, the concept of reincarnation, it's that a shitty person uh, gets, uh, turned into something, uh, not turn a uh, shitty person gets reincarnated as a creature that is, uh, either lower on the food chain or has less opportunity than the, the previous life had, uh, and the better a person is, the better the thing that they're reborn as is. So, um, basically, this, uh, creature, whatever, uh, <sighs> got caught up when, uh, something something died and uh the baby owl bear was close enough nearby and uh an enormous influx of uh magic of some sort caught it and uh this is an adult owl bear uh like this is actually a, almost an elderly owl bear it's close to like uh death so you get the idea that this owl bear wanted to go out with its boots on uh and that when this bear finally died the egg would have just ended up hatching anyway this is the the owl bear is dead, so now the curse is uh like the curse keeping the reincarnation from happening uh is it's not even a curse actually it reads like a curse, but it's actually a sort of barrier magic hmm. Hmm. close Petra's enough just standing here in the background, man oh no, don't worry about it it's fine and you hear a crack oh, oh, okay oh, good. Good. okay crack, crack. let's go back let's. Uh, Nor just uh, fun thing. Uh, Graham is not going away from this because they are too interested in this. Freaking Pet just grabbing Graham and <laughs> pulling them back a little bit. No, let me see. I'm not saying the matter. No. Uh, and, and Hammer Space Pet is like pulling out actually a shield. Oh my uh, god. Pet, she got there are from, uh... <laughs> there are more cracks and eventually thunk thunk thunk. Thunk, uh, and a fist, uh, dark brown, punches out of the side of the egg. Uh, mm. And it scrabbles at the edges of the hole that it's just made, uh, and Aww. then uh, just crack, 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 and then immediately a huge shard of ice shoots out of the egg, cracks it directly down the middle, and uh, Nor, you've got a doppelganger. Oh. What? Oh, oh what? shit. Me grabbing oh. that I did. Oh. <laughs> okay. Um. What? <laughs> and, uh, Hello? this, whoever this is, just falls out of the egg. They are naked. <laughs> Sorry about that. Looking around. Nice. Breathing hard. Uh, and, uh, their eyes are wild, uh, and they reach up to their throat, and they, they grab at it. Look around. They make eye contact with, with, with Nor. Uh -huh. Right in the eyes. What in the concept? Um, Hello? Nor's not there anymore, by the way. He just misty stepped away again, and he's gone. <laughs> Fuck this, actually. And, uh, the, the creature looks around and is just like, Puffs of cold air coming out of it, uh, out of his mouth, uh, and uh, then like scrabbles up, but legs are newborn weak, and just mm -hmm. kind of falls a little bit again. Uh, and then... Fumbly voice said, "Ow, oh, you uh, cut out." Uh... <laughs> Ow! 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 Now that's a cliffhanger. <laughs> <laughs> Full of this. And her shit in this house. What the hell just happened? Yep, all dead. Oh! He's, he's definitely. What was that? <laughs> don't worry about it. I don't know either. Hello? <laughs> what was that? I don't know what's happening. 
Why do you have a doppelganger and an egg and an owl bear? <laughs> <laughs> I don't Hello? know. I swear to God, I do not know what this is going on. I'll have not said anything off the start to me. I'm. Wow, okay. <laughs> okay. It could be. It could also just be that whatever was in the egg just imprinted on the nearest person and took on their appearance. Oh gosh. Ugh. And considering that the bear, when it died, literally crashed on top of Nor. Oh god, that might actually be it then. Ella! The uh, one thing I'm a little bit about is the, uh, the ice is obviously the opposite of Noah's fire. Yeah. yeah exactly, yeah. that's what I was asking. I'm scared. I'm terrified. <laughs> you think you're terrified? Noah just- I don't even know what Noah's doing, he's so fucking like, hmm. <laughs> oh no, Al's uh, dead. I almost died! We're never I'm gonna get peace. answers now. <laughs> Thank goodness we have backup recording. Yeah, man, I am fascinated by this. I'm also I fascinated was... by this. I, I, I was am... gonna get Petra go do nice things, and then this happened, and Petra's just like, okay, that can wait a bit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, March isn't even in the room. Yeah, like, Yo. Child, child is just like, la la, buddy. <laughs> yeah, child and Star are having a nice time setting up a bunny enclosure. Everyone else is just like, what? March is fucking just vibing. I don't know what's happening. Does no. March want to help the child and Star with their bunny enclosure? You know what? Yeah. March would love to do that. <laughs> I know. Anything but that other thing. Uh, I'm back. Sorry about that. Uh, there was a skip in the power, and my internet went out. Oh no! Oh, no. Right as I was in the middle of weaving, where did you guys lose me? Oh, um, um, North. Yeah, you they, had, they had they had chilly breath. Okay, like they were breathing hard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. and uh, they look around, and they're just desperately uh, this. Uh, oh. Oh. Wait, that's the funniest shit. Oh. The oh, game God. just does not want us to be all described. No, peck the game. We want this shit now. We want it. My head in my hands. Oh my fucking God. I guess it's break time. Ah! Uh, the water while Owl <laughs> tries to recover from power loss. <laughs> Owl! This is so sad. This is so okay, sad. I will admit, I, again, genuinely, I have no fucking idea what's going on. <laughs> None of us know what None of us know. Did, did it just imprint on Nor? I don't know! Fuck if I know! We'll see once Owl is able to explain. And the fact that, like, the fact that it's all mentioned, like, reincarnation and how good a person was in their previous life, like, I'm just sitting here like, hmm, does this mean this person was bad? Well, I don't know. Well, depend. well, it's, it freaking... The the reincarnation comes like if you were bad you were low on the food chain. Owl bears are pretty high in the food chain, man. <laughs> Fair enough. But they're still lower than I assume a human question mark, whatever this thing is. Uh, 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 I love how we're all just sitting here and we have none of us have any idea what's going on. Not a goddamn clue. Like trying to guess with the none of the information. We're we're wildly spitballing here while Owl recovers. Mm -hmm. Ain't got a goddamn clue, but God, am I God, am I excited to find out? Invested. Oh shit! Hold on, actually, Lewis, you reminded me of something. Uh oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> Don't worry uh -oh. about us. We're discussing. I'm just delighted Grim got to see the curse stuff. Yeah. Grim did cut to immediately ping on the curse thing, like, "Hello, <laughs> what is this?" Ooh. <laughs> the the thing that Graham wants most right now is to go help up this guy and figure shit out. Owl spotted in the chat. 
<laughs> Peanut <laughs> gallery! Tumbling <laughs> over stead. Sometimes I can hear your damn voice. Hey, Lewis. Oh god, oh god. Yeah? Oh god. <laughs> Let's come here for a second. I'm already here. <laughs> I'm being dragged into the DMs. Oh no. <laughs> I am literally losing my mind right now. You guys can't hear it because I'm not. Oh no, we can hear it. <laughs> Oh man, oh man, oh man. Man. Yeah. Man. Yeah. Hey, you didn't need a quick question. After you only one of us has played in a campaign DM fight over before, was this the kind of shit that went on the silver screen? Um. <laughs> not a precisely this kind of thing, but I was. If this, if this has anything potentially to do with, uh, you know, Noah's backstory, uh, oh. Al, Al is very good at bringing it in, in wild ways. Nice. Me putting my head in my hands. I <laughs> might have <laughs> suspicion. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I might have several suspicions. <laughs> Al, when do you come back from the war? Oh, Owl in the peanut gallery for the recording is saying that there's brownouts currently, which is why they have not returned yet. This is the worst timeline. Yeah, this is like the worst time. <laughs> Owl! No! Owl, you good? Well, um... Yeah, I ended the recording. What if uh, we take a little break? There, we have backup recordings going right on right now. now so. Yeah. We could take a little break until your internet more stable. Mm -hmm. No, it's, it's, it's all good. We reached the part that I wanted to reach. <laughs> yes, oh the part God. where everyone's screaming and going, what the fuck? We yeah, everyone's just like, why are you so insistent on having Nora go hunting? I thought you were so insistent on having Nora go hunting because you wanted to fucking decimate this poor mine of four. Yeah, we thought you were just bullying the poor... The poor oh, bitch. it's a little bit of both. Also, the bullying goes far, far, far further than you expect. <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice. Uh, we still have backup recordings going, though, if we want to, like, if we want to get that little bit of, uh, intro that you oh, kept cutting shit. out on. Yeah. <laughs> no, okay. we haven't... <laughs> yeah. Okay, so basically, uh, this, this, uh, this creature, uh, this is actually a person looks exactly like Nor. Uh, except for instead of, uh, like, brown-red eyes, they're, like, uh, dark sort of blue-brown eyes. Mm-hmm. And, uh, they, they emerge from this egg naked and, uh, covered in egg goo, yeah. which is gross, but it's part of the miracle of life, I guess. Um, <laughs> <laughs> uh, and they, they immediately are like, take their first breath, and then, uh, they just, uh, they, they shout, where am I? Oh god, did they kill him? Oh, fun. Oh, oh fun. Oh, fun. <laughs> oh, fun. Uh, I'm having I all... kinda, I wanna roll a thing, but also I wanna wait for us to get back in game before we Yeah, I along. think, I think mm -hmm. that's, we can, that's a good question mark exclamation point thing to leave it on for next yeah. time. Yeah. Yep, there we go. That's yeah. the end. I hope you had a good time. Yeah. So many questions. So many questions. Mm. And none of the answers. Oh, I fully expect to be yelled at by, uh, by fucking vamp. Oh, yes. Yeah. You know what? I'm too tempted. I'm gonna roll now and I'm not gonna explain anything. <laughs> <laughs> You would have hit my fucking hand. I am rolling this shit. Don't mind me. <laughs> That's great. Don't worry about it. Uh, is it in hold on, Lewis, is it by any chance uh intelligence? Or no, is it's it not. Cool. <laughs> Never mind then. I'm just sitting here, man. 
Me too. <laughs> I'm losing my goddamn mind. I have to write the rest of the episode. Like, half the party is seeing the shit, the other half is making a fucking pen for the bunny. Yeah, because... <laughs> obviously. Yeah. Because these are the two important things. Man. Anyway, Man. uh, Vamp. Vamp. Yes. Vamp. <laughs> yes. Vamp. Yes, my beloved- oh, my lovely VM, who I love very, very much. Fuck. Hey, Vamp, how you- how you feeling? Hmm. <laughs> I don't know all. In the span of an hour, I've- we've gone from, um, hunting an owlbear, to, um, an egg being an owlbear, to the egg hatching into a human, question mark, to, um, that human looking exactly like Nor, question mark, question mark. To the human being ice eat question mark question mark question mark exclamation point <laughs> standing here man <laughs> man i hope you're having a good time oh we're having a wonderful time i'm putting my head in my having hands. great fun anyway if the recording's done i'm gonna go to the bathroom i love you yeah i'm also yeah, gonna use the restroom Oh, yeah. yeah, man, see you guys later. Bye. Bye. Bye.